Hi, Automatic here for Automatic Games. And right now, uh, I'm aboard the, uh, the Adelaide, my father-in-law's boat. Yacht, I should say. No, that's a lie. We're, but we are in a building called the Adelaide. It's, uh, it's a condo where we go stay uh, annually. Anyways, the purpose of the, the following video is, is to follow our trip, our arduous trek, from the exotic environs of central Ohio uh, through the mountains of West Virginia where we were driving through the, through the clouds. We got to see a Tamarack. Um, we, we saw an abandoned sheriff's vehicle on the side of the road in South Carolina. We even saw uh, the aftermath of an atomic weapon used in South Carolina. At least that's how it appeared to us. Uh, you be the judge. That'll be in the, the second video that I, that I upload. Anyways, if you choose to watch this, watch at your own peril, because it's going to be boring as hell. Uh, essentially, this is just me documenting our, our vacation. But if you're inter interested in Fallout 76, uh, we do drive through West Virginia, but we're not going to show you a whole hell of a lot. Anyways, thanks for watching if you so choose to do that. I'm uh, Automatic. Enjoy. Salutations, shitheads. Uh, you're not really shitheads, but all I'm trying to show you here is the fallout shelter sign. I can't figure out how to zoom, but use my fingers, she says. Use my, use your fingers, that's what she said. So we're sailing down in a boat of car. We're sailing to uh, South Carolina, so we're gonna go through West Virginia. So at some point, I'm gonna edit this this junk together and show you the the setting of Fallout 76 and Tamarack. <laughs> yeah, Tamarack. And Lancaster. And this is Lancaster or Lancaster if you're from Ohio. <laughs> That's the home of General Sherman. There's all sorts of useless facts I could tell you, but I'm just going to I'm going to cut until we see something else more interesting. As I cut, I will regale my wife with stories about General Sherman. So, honey, you know in 1861, uh, how do I turn this off? Sherman So, uh, here we are following the Bum Garner Services truck and They do. They're. It's not what they're carrying is not intended for human consumption. Just in case you're, you get the same feeling that I get when I see a truck like that. That I want to eat, whatever's in there. Um, inedible, it says. Let me see if I can zoom in. Yeah, it's kind of jumpy. Anyways, I better not zoom in. That being the case, here's the Ohio River. So we're we're currently passing into West Virginia. Wild and wonderful I think is that still there yeah yeah they haven't changed that um, I, I thought it would be interesting uh, to anybody out there that wants to wanted to watch to show you the uh, the Point Pleasant bridge that collapsed with the Mothman but uh, that's not this bridge so while, while it would be interesting this is uh, this is not that bridge uh oh is right that's what they said when the bridge collapsed. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and so that's why we use this bridge. Because, you know, that Point Pleasant Bridge has a has a reputation. Probably a new bridge though, one would hope. At least we didn't get stuck by the Pelotonia people this time. That's true. Last time we got stuck by bicyclists. We got stuck on that bridge an hour or so past. Everybody was out of their cars. Kind of pissed, kind of wondering what was going on. I guess they weren't pissed. They were just wondering what was going on. And, um, bum garner services. And finally, like an hour later, here comes all these bicyclists. And I'm sympathetic to those that suffer with Pelotonia. Is that like what Lance Armstrong had? Where you only have one leg? 
<laughs> testicle. You only have one what? Chromosome? Testicle. <laughs> testicle. <laughs> Poor guy. Or no, actually, I think he had cancer. Sorry. Well, suffice to say, you're right. <laughs> Incidentally, uh, oh, you're right. Um, but, but yeah, this time we didn't get stuck by uh, by the Pelotonia bikers. By God bless them. The Pelotonians. The great invasion from West Virginia into Ohio. So we are in West Virginia now, which is so exciting. And, you know, in terms of showing you something that would be in Fallout 76, not so much. I mean, I don't know. We're going to drive through Charleston or, or buy it. So I guess I could show you that, you know, their Capitol hey, building. That should be wild and wonder. Yeah, that'll be. Yeah, so, yeah, buckle up. That'll be exciting. I know we are, are just chopping at the bit. To get to get through Charleston and be able to check out that dome. Um, made of pure gold. Yeah, made of pure West Virginian gold. <laughs> you know, if it sounds like I'm being mean, and maybe you are from West Virginia, though I highly doubt it. And if even if you were, it's not like you have an internet connection to be able to watch this. Um, I'm sorry. But I don't want to sound like a dick. Don't say anything. <laughs> okay, but you thought it. I, I thought it too. Uh, but you know, I, I'm, I like West Virginia. I like driving through it to get somewhere I want to be, because it's the only thing we can do. Did that car just? You prick. That one's doing it too. They want to turn right. Oh yeah, that's never mind. You're not a prick. You're just pragmatic. You're in a hurry. Incidentally, the Bum Gardener Services stuff is inedible. Just in case, just in case that's why you were pulling up. Because I know, but I wish we could eat it too. Are you out of Cheerios, guy? No, they're all over his lap, I think. All over his lap. Whoa. Did you clean yourself off? What's wrong, bud? You wanted to eat some bum gardener stuff? <laughs> we all did. We followed this truck for how long? Look, he's going to North Carolina. Is he? So are we. Yeah. We're going to Salem. To, Winston -Salem. to Well, to Winston-Salem, not Salem. Salem is... That's where they burned the witches. We're going to where they burn cigarettes. Or where they roll them. Anyways, I think that's enough for now. There's really nothing else to see in... In Ravenswood. Um, where character counts, it says. Where character counts. Because, well, yeah, what else is there? Sure, sure as hell doesn't count over there in Columbus, Ohio. Good looks don't count in Ravenswood. No. Definitely just character. <laughs> Good looks don't count. <laughs> Which is sad because the secret to happiness is good looks. <laughs> Anyways. I, I had just heard that. Oh, there's Huttons. Yay. Who doesn't love them some Huttons? <laughs> it's uh -huh. time to pick up a Hutton. Though. Yeah. Uh, how you doing on Huttons? We'd like a dozen if you got them. <laughs> We're fresh out. We're from Ohio. A... We're from across the river. We're from freaking civilization. Uh, anyways, that's mean. I apologize if you're from West Virginia. I apologize for what you probably have to deal with. Uh, that's it, folks. We cross the bridge. Next stop. Bye-bye, Ohio. Bye-bye, Ohio. We will make... We're Valley people. I'm not going to lie. I know people like JPEG are going to be out there because he's coming coming at you from the Rocky Mountains. So, you you know, if you talk about the Smoky Mountains or, or uh, Appalachia or something like that, he probably thinks it's kind of trite compared to the mountain range near him. But hey. it doesn't matter. I, I, I don't like high elevations. Or really, I just don't like mountains. Whether they're forest covered or just rocky, ginormous things. Yeah, dude, that was your turn to go. See, they don't even. Never mind. I better. If I'm going to talk trash about the locals, I better people turn this off. Oh, people in Ohio can drive. <laughs> <coughs> that's right. They, oh, they drive me nuts. Just not on OSU campus. Nah, that's true. College students can't do shit. Anyways. That'll do it. I'll see you in Charleston. Next stop, the Big Dome. So uh, get excited. I know I am.
Oh, am I recording? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. So, this is uh, Charleston, South Carolina. <laughs> no. No, this is Charleston, uh, West Virginia. Um, uh, Capitol Building will be up here on our right. We are kind of in the mountains now. Kind of. Yes, we're, we're definitely in the mountains. Again, it's not the Rockies, but... But they're pretty damn big nonetheless. So I'm trying. So there you go. You can kind of see a billboard. There's the Golden Dome. Made out of pure West Virginian gold. And it is. I think it's, it's right up against the river. I'm not positive. I mean, it's not like we ever stop here. No. No, you just keep driving because that's what you do. Uh, actually, we did stop here once and that's... Yeah, not a fun experience. Not good. Not good. We just stopped for some sleep and we got so much more. more. We took some little friends home. Yeah. Yeah, we got some West Virginian fleas. For free too, they didn't even charge a, charge extra. So yeah, there there's the dome. Uh oh. <laughs> I mean, it will be public. That's why I'm trying to refrain from singing. My my past history with singing notwithstanding, that was in front of small crowds. Um, yes, there it is. It, it is very pretty. I will give it that. It does sparkle, and every now and then a rainbow, the end of a rainbow will be right on top of that dome. And every Wednesday when they do the tornado sirens, the dome, it, this is just like test things. It's not a fish, you know, it's not war or anything, but it, it launches Pegasus, so Pegasi, which are of course unicorns with wings, and they come flying out of there, they go right up the rainbow and then onward and upward. Uh, West Virginian Pegasi. West Virginia has a lot of mythical creatures. We know that because we were told that. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah. Mothman is the only one I can think of. Chupacabra? Is that is that West Virginia? I think so. It's West Virginia or Mexico. I can't recall. I think it's West Virginia. You gotta, gotta keep an eye open for Chupacabra and uh, Yeti, of course. Uh, and Man Bear Pig. Man Bear Pig, Indomitable, Indomitable, Indomitable Snowman. Indominable. Indominable. <laughs> West Virginian Snowman. Fun fact, there would not be a West Virginia if it were not for Ohio. Oh, that's so true. It's true, yeah. It's yeah, which makes it a fun fact. Uh, you can't just say fun fact these days. You actually have to explain it. But yes, during the Civil War, obviously West Western Virginia didn't have a lot of plantations. I know, I know, the Civil War wasn't about slavery at all. <laughs> uh, but you know, seeing as West Virginia. <laughs> West Virginia wasn't all tied up in the whole uh, uh, slavery business uh, due to their lack of plantations. I mean, how the hell are you going to make a plantation here, right? Um, yeah, what are you going to pick? Like mountain berries? Or mountain berries. Yo, pick them mountain berries. <laughs> Watch out for the chupacabra. You're going to make me a mountain berry sweater. <laughs> mountain berry sandwich. Uh, I got a little blurry there. There, I fixed it. Um, but yeah, uh, you know, didn't really have the same vested interest in the Southern cause, which of course was uh, the state's right to um, own slaves. And uh, there was no federal plan for Western Virginia, but the governor of Ohio, I think it was Denison at the time, uh, as it turned out, McClellan, uh, who would ultimately, you know, be the commander in, well, the general of the Army of the Potomac. This has gotten way, this is way too much. It's like a history lesson. Yeah. 
Anyway, suffice to say, Ohio raised an army and invaded Western Virginia on their own accord. And essentially, West Virginia owes its existence to Ohio. Now, I know some of you jackasses from Pennsylvania would be like, well, if Ohio didn't do it, we'd probably have done it. <laughs> you know, or Indiana. I don't know that I've ever heard anybody say that. Oh, Joni, they say it all, all the time. All the time. We yeah. Just don't hear it. <laughs> yeah, you don't hear it. We're not there. Right, we're in Ohio. Yeah. But oh boy, the dirty mouths on these people <laughs> from Pittsburgh and, uh, 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 Racine, other yeah. Pennsylvanian towns. Uh, Beckley. Beckley. No, uh, Beckley's not Ew. Pennsylvania. I think Beckley's in, <laughs> in uh, it's Fallout 76. Um, I forgot that we were talking about Pennsylvania now. Yes, yes. Uh, so, you know, I, I showed you the dome. I want to. And yes, Beckley's in it. In the game, I, we went through Ripley. We actually stopped, and and we dined in Ripley. So that was believe it or not. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Ripley. Oh no. Oh no. <clears throat> but yeah, that's a. Uh, oh, th look! Get your Bibles. I shouldn't say that. I am not a. I'm not someone that would begrudge a, another person's religion, except for one or religion. Yes, yeah, you can read what you want in my imaginary country. Uh, <laughs> and even in my uh, real, life real. yeah, yeah, that's that's one area where imagination and realities link up. It's it's almost like that dumb firing Pegasus eye. It's uh it's one of those things that you both fantasize about but then you come to find out that yeah, that that happens every Wednesday at noon here in Charleston, South Carolina. Yep, and uh, everyone gets Ever, yeah, because they poop the Skittles in the cotton candy. Mm -hmm. And uh, sometimes you gotta kind of bob, really just eat your way through the cotton candy to find yourself a, a Skittle morsel. It's, it's magical. It's magically delicious. <clears throat> but yeah, ears are popping already. Just a little bit, it'll get worse. I, I again, I, I'm a valley person. I'm a valley girl at heart, and I always have been. These hills aren't getting any smaller. <laughs> that's that's the truth. That is the truth. They only get bigger, and then I don't know. After West Virginia, <laughs> we go into the truth. Billy said the truth. Yes, you can't hide the truth, can you, Billy? You can't hide the truth. I got a thing that'll work on you. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Took him a second, but he, yeah, he, he got really cheesy there. Um, there's not much more to say about, you know, there it was, Charleston. That's, I'm not an expert on West Virginia, even though I am. I live in the neighboring state that is responsible for, for liberating this place from the evil wrath of, of vagina proper. Uh, but I'm not an expert, but I would hazard to guess Charleston, Wheeling, those are your bigger cities. That was it. Um, it's kind of sad when a guy from Columbus, Ohio is, is, is kind of looking down on your city. No, I shouldn't say that. Columbus is a good sized city. Columbus, Cleveland, Cincinnati. Uh, you put them together. I mean, you almost have a quarter of St. Louis, I'd say. Yeah. All together. Or two fifths. <clears throat> two fifths. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> two fifths. It's enough of that. Uh, yeah, but beautiful country, and I don't know. I would not want to live here. I really wouldn't. Just, I think it's the rural nature of so much of it. Uh, you know, when we spent the night in Charleston, or attempted to, we actually purposefully waited until we got to Charleston just because I mean, we were dead tired, and we, we needed to, yeah, we needed to lay up somewhere, and that, that was going to be it, because we thought, well, it'll be a little more civilization. We don't, we don't want to go up some back road and find a motel and get murdered. 
you know, unlike so many people that do, we, we did not want that. Right. Um, we didn't want to end up on ID Discovery. Di yeah. Whatever it is. Yeah, Discovery ID or ID Discovery. Who's that detective? Joe, Joe Kenda. Joe Kenda. I didn't want Joe Kenda. Granted, he's from Colorado, but but he's retired now. He might do uh, freelance work. Anyways, I don't want him having to open up my investigation because I was dead up in some, I don't know, dead up in some West West Virginian mountain. Yeah. Yeah. I've, but if. This is a long segment. This is. I think. <laughs> That, long out of Charleston. <laughs> yeah, Charleston was two days ago. <laughs> so, I forget if I had a point. So, yeah, though, then we stopped at Charleston and, and got this motel, it hotel. It was hard to find a motel, though. We yeah. thought, like, because it was the capital city, there'd be hotels everywhere. And How wrong we so were. Much. No. Probably because they know that nobody wants to stay here. <laughs> Again. If you are from West Virginia, our apologies in advance, or after the fact in this case. But, so yeah, we, we found this hotel, motel, Holiday Inn, and at the same time, it we found a bunch of fleas in there, and then we got the hell out without really sleeping. So it was terrible. It was terrible. We basically stopped, paid them some money, they hooked us up with fleas, we're back on the road. And it was stupid of us to want to stay in Charleston because... It's so close to the Ohio River. We really just cross that river. And yeah. now, granted, we still have to get to central Ohio. Maybe like three hours or something. Yeah. Like that. So but, home, but. Yeah. But being a valley person, <clears throat> I would have been fine staying almost anywhere in Ohio. It's, it's these mountain folk. It's their motels. I've, and their fleas. Their mountain fleas. Their mountain fleas. <laughs> and those are big fleas. Another mythological beast found here in West Virginia. Great food, fine craft, and gifts. Artisans at work, all oh, there at Tamarack, they start advertising that pretty damn far out. And yeah, I think it was like 27 miles. Was yeah. One of the first uh, and the other, yeah, they're. they're Slogan is the best of West Virginia. I guess I've already, we've already covered is that. The accent for that coming up. I have, what did that Unless say? Four miles or something? Okay. I mean, uh, you'll, it's Tamarack, Joni. You'll know. I'll see it. Yeah. There'll be West Virginians trying to, like, just wave you over. just don't want to pass it. I, I know. Well, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if you pass there. Oh, this is fun. Yeah. Let's say what you. Oh, my God. Boy. Appreciate it, guys. <laughs> Swift. Sure wish I finished training. That's what SWIFT stands for. Because those assholes don't know how to drive. They never finish training. That is like the imperial... It's the empire of the damn trucking industry. Mass-produced, shitty-ass company. I get it. Semis are the backbone of this country, yes. But I don't like SWIFT. I really don't. And it's not because of what this guy just did. No. It's just, they're swift. Ask any trucker. Some of you uh, were truckers. I know that for a fact. Buy the Green Briar. That's what that Tamarack sign said. It said buy the Green Briar? Yeah, food by the Green Briar. Oh, that sounds that slightly romantic. So this is bad, and this truck might want over to go to Tamarack. I think everyone wants to go to Tamarack. Yep. Yeah. How's my driving? It asked. <laughs> yeah. So obviously, Tamarack is near Beckley. Um, Beckley's, it's it's on the map. You know what I mean? It's one of those West Virginian towns. It's sure to be in Fallout 76. I mean, it's like Harbor's Ferry will be in there. Um, obviously, Charleston, maybe Wheeling. I don't know how far north they go. <clears throat> the yeah, Travel Plaza is part of Tamarack. One mile, so don't get all... Don't make it around. Jesus. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I know, not the response you were looking for, but... You can't miss Tamarack. It's the best of West Virginia. I know, that's why I'm thinking... 
take a number and get in the right lane, but that's okay. There. That's what I tried to do, and then I got stuck behind the drums. The best of West Virginia. If my hand wasn't shaking so much because I'm nervous and excited <laughs> about Tamarack. That other soul said art <clears throat> and soul of the mountains. Ah, who can blame them? They did not. Who needs an education when you've got Tamarack? And I have to say, though, every time we've been to Tamarack, I've never seen artisans at work. Well, there are. No, no, I haven't either, unless <laughs> unless the people at Sabaro are artisans. Right. Um, Maybe Starbucks people? No, those are baristas. You know, all that shit is over here to your right, though. Uh, it's up on the hill higher. So I got off on the wrong exit. No, no, oh. no, no. It's just, it's most people that, the best of West Virginia. <laughs> Keep telling us that. Oh, they will. Um... <laughs> Here it is again. Best of West Virginia. This is as good as it gets, is what they're saying. Right. Uh, yeah, but all that shit is up. Sorry, Billy. I, I should have cursed him for it. Oh, yeah. Okay. So all that stuff's up there. We want to go to the travel plaza, right? Yeah. Okay. That's right. So we've never really actually been to Tamarack. Tamarack, yeah. Is we've it? just been to the travel plaza. Yeah, with all the crap I give it, I've never actually <laughs> taken the time to go up to what? Tamarack. So is it like a mall or something? Yeah. Okay. It's a mall. It, there are artisans okay. at work there. Yeah. yeah, apparently. I don't know what they're doing. What do artisans do? They art? Make sandwiches. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I mean, I went to liberal arts college. I'm not an artisan. Right. Want my money back? <laughs> I, honestly, I only bought supplies. I didn't pay tuition. Uh, long story. It's not really a long story, but suffice to say, I did not pay tuition. I, I went to a very expensive college. And this sign says, "Don't miss Tamarack. Only 250 yards away." <laughs> yeah, you're so close. So, yeah, walk on over. It's you're only so, like two and a half football fields. You're so close. You ought not miss it, but we do. Every, Every time. single time. Because what are we going to do? Go see a movie? Like, no, we want to get to our destination. Yeah, Myrtle Beach sounds good. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, West Virginia, but... And if it weren't for the Starbucks at the Travel Plaza, I wouldn't even stop here, I don't think. Wow. That's... That's pretty harsh. <sighs> says something. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Lovely centerpiece, isn't it? I wonder who took the time to arrange that for us. And uh, it looks like you, you pump your own water. Yeah, how about that? That's handy. Yeah, that is what that is, right? Yeah, of course it is. It says Iowa on it. It's come a long way. Well, <clears throat> over there is Joni and Billy. Uh, we're getting ready to leave Tamarack. And move on down the road. But yes, this is it. And, and no, as stated, we've never actually been to Tamarack proper. But this is north of Beckley. Beckley is at the University of West Virginia. And all that stuff is here. Uh, West Virginia Tech. I kind of sold the, the place short. More, more towns have come to mind. There's Clarksburg and Parkersburg and Morganstown and... I just looked at a map, so there you go. But uh, I'm trying to think off the top of Huntington, of course, Huntington, West Virginia. Only in West Virginia, folks. No, <laughs> no, that, that's not true. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. But I digress. Uh, yeah, so we'll head back to the car. With the little guy. We got our Starbucks. So that's that's cool. I'm not such a fan, but Joni is, and I'll drink it. This is their cup of tea. Chunky style, I guess. Doesn't look very tea-like. I think our friends across the pond would correct us on that. That's not tea. Yeah, it's just a cup. Just a cup. It's much ado about nothing. It's how I do. 
But I-77, that's bound to be in uh, Fallout 76. It is, after all, uh, the major artery. One of them, anyways. One of, one of maybe two or three super major arteries through West Virginia. Uh, I think we're going to go through one of those big tunnels. I would imagine those... I, I would think, you know, if I was making a game based in West Virginia, yeah, I would have to put some of those mountain tunnels in. Um, so I'll tell you what, when we get to one, we'll go ahead and film that. I don't know if Joni's waiting for me. I'm kind of waiting for her, is, is the truth. I shouldn't even film myself. I'm a little disheveled. Long, you know, road trip day. You don't necessarily try to look your best for that. Especially going south. Anyways. Yeah, you can say that again. We're not done with Tamarack yet. We're going to get some gas. <clears throat> As if McDonald's didn't give us enough gas. I was like, are we going to go to Sephora? <laughs> yeah, that would straight up be gas. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> this is self gas. It's where you do it yourself. For you, for you go-getters. Do they still have? Yeah, they got full service. Actually, that gas station closest to our house has full service. Yeah, I pulled at the wrong pump oh, before. Oh, this Yeah, and they they get a little ticked off when they come out and only to find that you're willing to pump your own gas. Attitude is what they give you. Here's some gray clouds. I wonder if we'll be going into them. Yeah. And then over there, you can see another, uh, well, I would call them fuel trucks, but, you know, they carry everything in there. In, anyways, whatever's in there is probably edible, because I don't see a sign to the contrary. <laughs> so well, we might stop and have a bite of that. But, yes... Almost heaven, I'd say. West Virginia. Uh, Blue Ridge Mountains. Shenandoah River. And you know, life is older. Older than the trees. Younger than the mountains. What is it? Swinging in the breeze? Uh, that's how the words go. Yeah, I, I gotta say that the, the, the version of, of uh, Country Roads for Fallout 76. That's got to be my favorite version of that song. Uh, you know, I, I like John Denver. I mean, I don't own any of his, his music, but I like him. But uh, that version for that Bethesda put together, it's it's got more soul. I don't know. That's, that's kind of what my, that's what my wife said, and I can't help but agree, uh, which is both a survival tactic, but also uh, when she's, legitimately right as she is in this case you then yeah you're compelled to agree anyways folks see you at the tunnel we're gonna be heading out of tamarack and moving on down the road